I'm like, what is this fuck me for? Gen Z. We're not millennials. I don't even know how I look. You know, this whole time I didn't even look at myself. All right, y'all. So from Crumble, we got we got the four pack, and then we got the four pack: cookie dough crunch, peanut butter brittle, raspberry cheesecake, and vanilla bean. Yeah, my camera too. My camera. Um, sorry. We got the brownie jam. I forgot. I completely forgot. Yeah, the brownie jam. That's peanut butter. Peanut butter cookies and cream. And then the pumpkin chocolate chip. And that's strawberry something, right? Or is that a sugar cookie? They look really good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so which one, which ice cream do you want to try first? I want this one because I know I like it. No, actually, raspberry cheesecake seems like it would be a hit with snickerdoodle. Okay, you got there. What you trying? You don't like it? It's busting. What? What is it? It's busting. Oh my god. Stupid. What? So, this, this is raspberry cheesecake. That sounds like it busts. I've never heard nothing like that before. Crust is so bare. It literally tastes like crust. I love how it's not too, too cold mm -hmm. or too, too soft. Peanut oh, yeah. butter batter brittle. Oh, is it batter? Mm -mm, it's a brittle. 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 Did you show them the little drink? No, oh, I did not. Oh my gosh, I'm fainting. This is good. It tastes like peanut ice cream. I like the peanuts in it. Because I like peanuts on my Sundays. We didn't think this through because these are going to melt. It's okay. That cookie dough one is good. It just hit me. And then it hit me. Oh, where's my purse? I got hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. I don't too. I think mine's easier to get to. I low key want to try this pumpkin chocolate chip first. What you want? Me try? too, but I want to try the snickerdoodle real bad. Ah! Mm. Yeah, yeah. No, bro. Mm -mm. I like the mm, that chocolate. That's different. It tastes like dark chocolate, though. Next, which one? Snickerdoodle. This is really soft. I like it. I, that's because I like brownies, so. Mm. You don't like it? Mm -hmm. I just felt like I was having a sweets overload. What are they doing mm. in the drive thru? They probably will, though. Well. They need to make a glazed donut, donut cookie. I think they did. A chocolate, no, like a chocolate. Chocolate? Did you say chocolate? Chocolate! Donut cook cookie. Chocolate. 
We didn't try the vanilla one. We didn't because it's vanilla. Come on. So? We didn't try the snickerdoodle one. Let's try the snickerdoodle. What is going on? How can I find somebody else? Mm -hmm. I don't know, it kind of low-key tastes like exactly. a sugar cookie, but exactly. with like seasoning. Barely any seasoning. With like a cinnamon seasoning. It tastes too much cinnamon. So, what do you rate each cookie? Snickerdoodle, I'm going to get that like a, I'm going to get it like a seven. Pumpkin, I like. I'm going to get that a good eight. The cookies and cream thing. It's good, actually, I think. I'm going to get that like a eight. And then the brownie, I like it. was going to get it like a nine. For the Snickerdoodle one. I give it three. Pumpkin chocolate chip one, a uh, 4.5. I don't really want to say a five because it's not like halfway there for me. And I'm going to say four because that's like a little too low. Mm. So like a 4.5. The peanut butter cookies and cream tastes like Reese's Puffs. Like mm. the cereal. It don't taste like Reese's. It tastes like Reese's Puffs. Yeah. I rate it a eight. Mm. The brownie mm. batter one, I give it six. A low six because it's kind of too chocolatey. I don't like too too much chocolate. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's I like it's chocolate it. chips like inside of the chocolate batter, so it's like really dense and like just tastes like it's chocolate mush. It's I don't really like that part, but flavor wise, it gives it a six. So the ice cream, mm. raspberry cheesecake. Eight. Mm. Cookie one. Oh, I forgot how it tastes. I you think like I'm gonna it. get it. Like, I get like a six. But I think you like the cheesecake one. The bo the the bo the. Gotcha. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> that just said <hit> black. <laughs> what is my peanut brittle? Second to the raspberry. Really? And then the vanilla bean. The vanilla bean just tastes like vanilla ice cream. Yes, what she said. On the scales of vanilla bean ice creams, I think I had better. It's uh, it's kind of a three. The peanut brittle one, that's number two. So we got the same rating. Yeah. Mm. Literally. The raspberry cheesecake is really, really good. Like the pieces of the ice cream or the parts of the ice cream that taste like crust, taste nice. like real cheesecake crust. Like they just took mm -hmm. it off the cheesecake and mm -hmm. put it in there and it's blended so good. It's not like grainy, like how you yeah. do cookie dough. Third. That's our crumble review. Yeah. Yeah, clap it. We're not, we're not happy. This is like our third Damn one. Mm -hmm. Second or third? I might as well go to my car to look for my band so I can lay my edges. But then I wanted to make myself something to eat so I'm not hungry in there. Um, Don't look at my nails. Yes, I went to Target now. Crazy, right? Did y'all think I was going to get the job? Did you? Because I did. I did. Okay. Hey, guys, I have fun in the city. Anyway. I don't know why in my brain I switched it, but I'm kind of glad that I did because if I didn't, I would have been stressing like the whole way here. It's okay because I got here after nine hours, but I have three more things to do for training and then I'm going to be on the floor. I am working in styles and apparel or whatever you want to call it. They call it styles here. Style. I'm about to sign in and finish my training so I can get out of here. Oops. Yeah. I just finished my training. I was sitting here, somebody came and told me like when I was done to go back to the fitting room so I could start like my handbound training. So I'm about to go get that. But I wanted to put my stuff in the locker first. currently doing something that I don't know what it's called but I'm on the scanner and I feel official. I'm basically putting things away from these boxes and I just use the scanner to scan it to see where it goes and then it goes Q50. I don't know where the hell that is. This is my first day in the floor. I'm gonna find Q50. So I have these shoes but it's on a hanger so I'm here with the shoes now but 
I have to find the shoes for the hanger and if I can't, then I'm gonna just put it back and wait for my trainer. Oh, I see shoes on the hanger. I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh, what if I get fired? It says it goes to Q50. So I found like where the other ones go. So like they're literally these shoes, but there's no space down there. And I found one more space up here. So um, I'm gonna put them here. I am currently, I forgot what it's called, but I'm doing what I told you I was doing. I just can't use the bathroom because the other one, like the one for everybody, somebody was like stinking it up. So I came to this one. It's the other stinky. But I'm getting ready to go back out there. I've been here since nine. But look at me. Getting real. So I can get employed. This was an accident from yesterday what I had on because I like to wear little scrunchies but it's pink like it looks it looks kind of coral or like tan but it's really pink like in real life it looks more pink and it goes so good with my socks and then the red in my socks it goes good with my like whole outfit so yeah I'm excited I love it Ten out of ten. so I'm in the break room on my 15 and I'm using my front camera but so far it's cool it's just like I feel kind of lost because I gotta learn how to do new things and like learn about the floor it's not really like too much yet the only thing that I can sing is that when you go on your break you have to call it over the walkie and I don't like that because everybody's hearing well everybody that has their volume up I don't like that even though nobody literally knows who I am like two people asked me for help and didn't know how to help three people actually and one of them spoke another language so I was kind of like not knowing what to do but then we got another one of the other people that asked me for help was literally somebody that worked at Target so he ended up helping me <laughs> but it's okay um I have to go back on the floor at 2 30 but I'm not stressing so I'm gonna eat a little bit because I'm really hungry and then I'm gonna go back out there. I'm doing reshop, but basically I'm walking around with this cart. It's not really a cart, it's like a wardrobe. I'm like putting everything back, right? So that's cool. It's not too much right now, but it's just like once it gets to this little thing, the zebra, I'm confused because I don't know how to work it yet. So, so far so good, just new. I feel like I wanna be that girl. <clears throat> I didn't tell y'all what I was eating. I'm eating curry beef with white rice and potatoes, my mom made it. And then, cut up, because I feel like I'm such a healthy bitch. So I just wanted to come on it. <laughs> hey. So, yeah, I went to get Starbucks because I was really, really, really tired. I hate compliance too, I don't even know how. I guess I was just working too long without taking a break or my lunch. Look at all this camera I got in my drink. I don't know, I need an extra sweet and extra espresso. Talk to you later. It's a camera in here that's so embarrassing. Like right now I'm getting one of these little things. I have time because it's like 9.30 and I'm not supposed to clock in until 10. So who could really be mad at me right now? Nobody. When you first come in, they want you to get one of these in the walkie so when you get one of these it's this little book down here and the one that you have you have to write your name and like when you check it out i don't have a holder i don't have a holder for this and i needed one because it was like one that went on my hip yesterday hopefully i can find one i don't even know where to get them from you get a walkie and then you go and start your damn day I'm on the front camera. I feel like I just need to tell y'all, but I just got done eating. They had red robin for us, like burgers. And they potato chips right now. But what y'all see me doing just now was um, zoning. And that's basically where you're putting everything where it belongs. Hey, I look like it's the end of the day, literally. Like, end of my shift. But I'm about to clock out. I'm holding it like this so people can think I'm playing a game. So, yeah. See you soon.
<laughs> hey guys, front camera gang. Look how my freaking steering wheel turned white, but the front of it is pink as hell. It's because the sun. I'm like damn near home. Like I waited all the way until the end to start recording. But I'm about to go home and change my clothes because I actually have time to do that today. Every other day that I like get off of Target to go to do nails, I have not had time because I always like set it like my time that they can book 30 minutes after when I'm supposed to get off and I need to stop doing that but I do that so I can get more appointments in my day. If you haven't listened to the song City Girls by Chris Brown and Young Thug which is an old old song and I'm just it's not that old but it's like an old song. If you haven't listened to it you need to listen to it because I love that song and that's my newest obsession. I'm currently at Target for an overnight shift but I didn't ever end my video so I'm ending it here. Um, thank you for watching. It's kind of a weird ending, but I'm trying to hurry up and get it out. So yeah, thank you so much and see you later. Bye.